Good evening, fellow amateur radio operators. This is KC8ZKI, a.k.a. the QRP guy. Back with another video. I'm showing you here is my favorite Go Pack. So this little Go Pack here contains everything I need to operate 160 meters through 10 meters uh, out in the field. So let's take a look what's in the bag. And when I'm finished with this video, I'm going to post uh, links to all of the equipment, including the bag. So if you like it, you can go out and find them yourself. So what do I have in the bag? I have got one of the most important pieces, the LDG 9 to 1 Unin. I've got a 16 foot piece of RG8X. And I've got 53 feet of wire wrapped around a chameleon antenna winder. So that combination there, some people call it the magic combination. Uh, the magic is found with the fact that the 9-to-1 the nine Unin with the 53-foot piece of wire is a non-resonant combination that, when presented to the radio, is an impedance that is reasonable. It's, it's not too high, it's not too low, and so the antenna tuner can tune out that impedance. Uh, it's within the range of a decent antenna tuner. Uh, depending on where you set it up, you may be able to get it with a three to one antenna tuner. I've got the uh, Zygu G90 here, which has an exceptional tuner in it that actually does better than three to one. And it always tunes this on every band, 160 through 10, no problem. So what else is in the bag? I mentioned the Zygu G90. And uh, what I did is I've got it in this little pocket here in the bag. And I'm sorry for my video skills. Not the greatest. I'm just using an iPhone here. So that little pocket there, I put a hard piece of plastic down in the bottom. Because when I first put that in, I noticed that these extensions on the bottom of the radio want to pierce the bag. And I didn't want that to happen. So I put a piece of hard plastic in the bottom of that pocket. And that stops that from happening. I've got a Miedi rechargeable lithium uh, what is it? A lithium iron phosphate battery, uh, six amp hours, 67 ish, uh, watt hours. I get some really good life out of this battery. Um, I, I've never run it down in the field, you know, not that I stay in the field that long, but I, I've never wanted for more. So I can't really tell you how long you could do the math. There is, uh, the power cord. And then in the front pocket, I've got the, uh, Bumbling video again. Excuse my bumbling. Um, the, the microphone. So that's it. That is everything I need right there to operate in the field 160 meters through 10 meters. I earlier today used this combination to make a contact while I was in the park at lunch. So I will make that the part two. So if you want to see how this all works together, watch part two. Thank you.